What you see here is the prototype of a small experimental sort of Zeppelin. And what you're about to see in this report is that it's been equipped with sophisticated radars and sensors with one goal in mind, to become a new and efficient tool for maritime surveillance. It's a busy morning for scientists at this research facility in northern Italy. Radar and sensor specialists and experts in aerostatic balloons are teaming up to try a research tool newly developed here for the first time. This prototype is a Zeppelin. It's based on the principle of hydrostatic push, based on different densities of different gases. It uses helium, which is lighter than air, to generate propulsion up. In case of any problems, such as puncture or tyre or any other issue during flight management, it does not fall. It instead glides smoothly without causing any harm. The experimental Zeppelin is 9 metres long. It can lift up to 15 kilos of equipment. And it's no ordinary equipment. A path antenna with very narrow angle beam, uh, ra uh, radiative beam. The um, radar is incorporated inside with the um, uh, acquisition device, uh, signal generator and um, motion sensors, GPS, magnetometer and so on. The prototype has been developed at the Melissa Laboratory in the Joint Research Center, with a very precise mission in mind. We're experimenting with this alliance between platforms and sensors to help our capacity to spot and rescue the small boats with immigrants that cross the Mediterranean Sea. It's basically an attempt to combine a relatively new platform with old technologies to obtain something efficient, reliable, low cost and easily managed for maritime surveillance. It was in this lab that the sensors and antennae were assembled. The specialists say the technical challenges were huge. My colleagues give me the electronic circuits and I had to find a way to insert those circuits mechanically into this box. Before coming to the final product, you must find good ways to combine both electronic and mechanical parts in a balanced way. The final product has to be compact, well balanced, and it must work well. Now, researchers are looking ahead for ways to improve the efficiency of the current system even further. In the future, we could use smaller aerostatic balloons to see if we could increase our efficiency, eventually using less powerful sensors, but in a much greater quantity. Researchers hope their work will provide European countries with accurate scientific evidence to support their immigration policies with the final goal of saving further lives. <laughs>